This is Sophie Heller, and this is an ACT geometry question. The question is asking us this abstract question about the, the degree measures of an angle and their ratios. It's telling us we have a ratio of 2 to 4 to 6 for our three angles in the triangle. And then it's telling us that they want the me how much greater the largest angle is than the smallest angle. So I never like to work in abstracts with these SAT questions. So why don't we just write an equation? So we know that any triangle, no matter how big it is, is going to have its three angles add up to 180. So we can use these ratios and make an equation based on 180. So we can say 2x, so x is um, a degree of an angle, plus 4x, plus 6x, is all going to add up to 180. So why don't we solve for x so we're not working in abstracts? So we can say 12x equals 180, and let's divide by 12 x equals 15. So it might be tempting to choose 15, but luckily that's not one of our choices. Because they're asking us how much bigger is this largest angle than the smallest angle. So this is our largest angle, our 6x, and our smallest angle is 2x. So let's multiply it out. So we, want, we don't want to say 6x, we want 6 times 15, and that's going to be 90. And we want to say 2 times 15, which is 30. So we want the difference between them, so let's subtract. And the difference is 60 degrees, and that's choice E.